changes an entire trajectory traje, trajectory of a day. Also, I think I've bitten my tongue like four times. But I have no idea because I cannot feel it. Anyways, um, yeah, sorry we've been gone so much. Um, we're doing a countertop down in lower Alabama and we finally got that completed. It looks gorgeous. I've been editing down HNN, um, a, a video for you guys for that, but it's just not done yet. Um, and then I had to go get a root canal today. And now I can't feel like from my temple, this, all of this, even my eye is tingling. Anyways, um, that is not the point of this video. Also, hey, 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 I know it's going to be a great video and um, I can't wait to show you guys. It was a whole process because it's a porn place and anytime you do a porn place, it's like a whole deal. So this is going to be a shorter video today because I can't really talk and I have to get caught up on sending orders. It, look, it feels weird, but I know it looks like super weird. I know tomorrow or whenever this wears off, like, oh, I bet. Anyways, so I wanted to show you guys some new um, clear shapes that Jeff is cutting. They look amazing. I literally just walked in, so the dogs are still at a thousand PS. Canvas decided today she's gonna eat one of my remotes, so that's fun. Um, so these are three of the new shapes Jeff is designing. We have a stingray. I I was thinking that it. Anybody else just walk around their studio sometimes and get colors on them that you're not really sure where I came from? What's up, Jennifer? Just me. Cool. So I thought initially that this, I think it's about seven inches, is too big for a coaster. But it's really not because you want to have like that larger surface area. Oh, what's on here? No idea what it is. Babe, go lay down. I hope you're having an awesome, awesome day today. Where was I? Um, so, yeah, I'm a little bit out of it because of going to the dentist and I can't really speak correctly and I keep biting my tongue, which I can't feel right now, but I know that later I'll be paying dearly for said tongue bites. Uh, in the meantime, I'm just going to show you guys these new shapes that Jeff cut. So when you get some of our clear shapes like this, all you do is you peel one side. All of them have like this brown paper backing so that when you art on one side, you peel it off and you leave one side. And then you art on that side, the one that you peeled. And then after it's cured, you peel the other side and then you have a no cleanup coaster, which if you're anything like me, the cleanup is easily the worst part of creating anything. Just me. Cool. And he did a splat, which is very much something that I love because I put splats and flutters on all of my, like, my artwork. Oh, just, just parked. Um, and so you do it just the same. You peel one side off. And then you leave one side on, and then after it's cured, you peel it. And then you have a no cleanup coaster. I always scuff these just a little bit to create a more of a tooth. Funny uh, choice of words, I suppose, and I'm having tooth probs. And anyways, the last one is, I don't know what, I don't know. I don't, I don't know what. Took us so long to do a palette, but here it is. Um, even there's little etching of where the little dots of different colors would be. Jennifer, this is going to be a super quick live. And the only reason why I'm here is because I miss you guys and you guys always make me feel better. So 
So I wanted to come in and say hi and show you guys some of the new news. Um, so since they're just etched in, you have to like take, you have to pull the little dots off separately, but I just use an exacto blade. What's up, DJ Fruit Loops? We have missed you. Sorry you're here on such a quick live type day. Um, but I'll be back live tomorrow with not a swollen face. Chillin. Chillin is amazing. Um, so yeah, I, I can't wait to art on one of these and I'll be back live tomorrow and I'll, I'll art on some of these new bad boys. As soon as I'm off the live, I will upload these to the website. But how cute are those? It even fits my thumb. But anyways, these are also coasters, but I suppose you could like do whatever you want with them. If you wanted to get crazy, like flavor plate, you could have like a big something. I'm going to have to tell him to etch it a little bit more deeply because y'all don't look at my nails. I'm embarrassed. Because the, itch the etching has gone through on some, but not others. So I will do some quality control checks before I send these particular coasters out. But definitely super into these guys. And we we're thinking about doing these clear shapes in a larger size. I don't know if that's something that you guys are interested in, like cradle board size. Uh, let me know down in the comments below the video if that's something you're interested in. And I will get to loading these up in the system. Um, right after I take some ibuprofen, because that Novocaine or whatever it is that they give you shots of, starting to wear off. And I'm scared. <laughs> I'm just the worst. How thick are they? They would be great router templates for inlays. I am not sure what that means, but these ones in particular, most of our coasters are eighth inch, but I can cut, I have access to this type of plexi that goes as thick as a quarter inch. So we stock eighth inch, three sixteenths and a quarter. So ultimately, if you want uh, something like this, that's a, a particular thickness or size, shoot me a message or when you order them, like put in the notes up there that you want a thicker uh, plastic or whatever it is you're working on. I'm really excited about pouring on this flat because that's very on brand for me as an artist personally. But I understand that these shapes are not for everybody. That's just what I'm super into. There's a classic artist, Nails Be Proud. <sighs> At least there's no like weird color paint stuck under them. I've been doing something a little different. I've been working on like typed flowers. <coughs> Dad's on. So I've been working on like typed flowers. I don't know if it's something that you guys even are interested in seeing, but working on that to kind of better my bees. In any case, yeah. The the whole point of this video is to show you guys these things. The pups are gonna get real loud in a second because dad's home, so I'm gonna let you guys go. Um, but I really wanna know, what's up Maria? I really wanna know what you guys think of our new shape. If you have a shape that you have been wanting that we don't have available, please comment down below. And yeah, I'm uh, going to rest my face. And I hope you all have an amazing rest of your today. I promise where tomorrow, our 6 p.m. Central Live, I will be doing an actual art piece for and with you guys. I just, today is just not the day with my face being what it is. I, I'm so sure I did damage to my tongue. I bet it was four times. Anyways, I'm going to go. Pipe flowers are so fun. Sounds good, Chris. Um, so, yeah, you guys have an awesome day. I'm going to load these to the website, and I'll see you guys tomorrow at 6 p.m. Central uh, for 
uh, another life. And um, Canvas Data Remote today. Um, yeah, I'll just load these today, and I will see you guys tomorrow. You can find these coaster shapes and a million others at our website, artistsforbeth.com. That's my husband. My name change paperwork in them. Anyways, you guys are amazing. We love you guys so much. And we'll see you guys tomorrow at 6 p.m. Central. <gasps> Bye. Oh, be kind to one another because you never know what someone's going through. Like dental work. See you guys in the next video. He's distracted. But we did a test so you don't have to. See you guys later.